In the last tutorial, we're working on making an advanced GUI for our Bash script. We're making a music player here. I asked you to finish uh, putting in your percentages on the labels over here. Um, this next step, we're going to show you how to actually make your GUI show up from a Bash script. So first thing we have to do is we have to save uh, this Glade file. So we're going to save it as, and I'm going to put it in a folder um, that I've already created called Bash GUI. And um, I'm going to call it my XMMS, uh, at dot glade. So we're going to save that. Now I'm going to go into that folder and we're going to run the command um, GTK dialog. If it's not installed in your system already, it's in your package manager. And uh, what we're going to do is we're going to give it the tell it the Glade file and what window we want to display. Now by default uh, this window is called window 1. And there it is, you can call it something else if you want to rename it right there under general by clicking on window 1 there. I'm just going to leave it as window 1 for right now. Um, but the way we, we tell the GTK dialog uh, application what we want is we give the switch uh, dash dash Glade dash XML because we're using a Glade XML file, that's what we've created and saved with the Glade uh, interface designer and we give it the name of the file uh, that we just created and then the program equals the window we want to open which is window 1. We press that and our application opens up. So that's how you get your app, your window to open up. Next thing we need to learn is how to send commands with uh, this from this GUI to actually run our bash code uh, and that's what our next tutorial is on uh, I hope you come back for it and uh, visit filmsbychris.com for more tutorials like this or uh, bashscripts.info that's bashscripts.info for more videos and tutorials like this